Hey folks, what's shaking? I have been ordering some boxes and super excited about new football cards. I bought quite a bit because the, the rumor was that Panini Mosaic football would be the last premium product that they make. You know, the Donruss is supposed to be out in about a month, but it's just normal paper. It's not as fancy as these cards. And I bought a bunch on Target's website when they became available. And my plan was is to compare two blaster boxes to one mega box. And then I have an extra mega box. Now they also released value packs. So two of these are $60. One of these is $60. And four value packs is $60. There are people on YouTube arguing about which is better between the three options. These will probably be the last mosaic that I buy. Uh, evidently, a judge declared a few days ago that the NFL Player Association's lawsuit with Panini and ending their contract, that they really can't just stop a contract right in the middle of Panini's effort to fulfill the contract. So it sounds like we will have more Panini football products coming out during this football season. The Donners one might be the last of 2023, but we will have other stuff in 2024, like everybody's favorite Panini Prism, Donners Optic. I love the Contenders and the Contenders Optic, optic because those have the rookie ticket autos. I can't afford it's too much of a gamble to go buy hobby boxes of those rookie ticket auto cards, so I will probably just buy the singles off of eBay of the ones, the ones that I want. One bad thing is three of our biggest quarterbacks out of the draft, well, one of them is not really that big, but uh, Bryce Young and C.J. Stroud have exclusive autograph contract with Fanatics. So you will not pull Bryce Young, C.J. Stroud. Will Levis is also one of those that has an exclusive. But it seems to me right now that nobody really cares that much about him. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the, these two away and this one away. And I'm going to save those for when the four value packs show up sometime next week. And we will do a comparison out of three different $60 options, which one has the best cards in it. Uh, one thing that I find interesting is, see the Mega Box has 42 cards in it, $60. The Blaster, the Blaster Boxes have 36 cards in each and those are $30 each. So you get a lot more cards by buying the blaster boxes. However, there are some cards in the mega box that do not appear anywhere else. I think the pink camo, and there are some other ones that are very much sought after. Um, I will try to research that before I cut the next video. So these three boxes are getting put away till next week. And this one here will be my first rip of 2023-2024 football. I'm hoping that I get some rookies from Anthony Richardson, C.J. Stroud, Bryce Young, B. John Robinson, uh, that Puka Nakua kid who's tearing it up for the Rams. Although I'm kind of worried that when Cooper Cup comes back and he's not on the injury list anymore, that he might not have as much attention as he's getting right now. But his, he doesn't have very many cards. I'm not even sure if Puka Nakua is in Mosaic. I haven't looked that up. I'll need to look that up. So I'm going to flip the table around, get the camera rolling, and we'll open this box, and it'll be my first look at the current year 
football cards, which is my favorite sport. I'm most excited about this. I will be having some more baseball coming in. I've got a box of women's soccer coming in. And uh, I haven't heard anything about basketball yet, but I'm thinking that when the Victor Wimbanyama stuff starts coming out, that everybody and their dog is going to be looking for that stuff. All right, so let's see what's in here. Okay, so here we go with the first football rip of the year. I am excited. Let's hope that we get something really good. I haven't had a ton of luck with ripping packs, although I opened a Monopoly basketball box at my mom's house and I got a, a really valuable Paulo Banquero rookie card that I sent to PSA to get graded and I got a PSA 10 on that. I'm still trying to sell it, but I think that maybe I just need Banquero to have some epic games once the NBA season begins. Okay, so we've got six packs. It says seven cards per pack. Let's see how these go. Dan Hampton. I'm really not a big fan of them putting cards of people who haven't been played in years, but whatever. Hey, here's Justin Jefferson. That was a great rookie to have a few years ago. Clinton Portis. Thunder Lane. Cam Akers. Isaiah Pacheco. And here we've got a gold one. Ooh, wow. Joe Burrow. Uh, I think... I thought the gold ones might be numbered, but... They are not. Okay, gold Joe Burrow, who is stinking it up like crazy so far this season. He's playing terrible. And then here, epic performer, Michael Vick. Huh, epic performer with some pit bulls. Okay, first pack, nothing that great. That gold card is, is probably the best one. All right, Michael Pittman Jr., Sky Moore, Rice Rice Baby, Elevate, greatest wide receiver of all time, Riley Moss, rookie card, Oh, well, here's a gold rookie of Darnell Washington. I don't know much about him, but I'll look him up. Calvin Ridley. Here's Elevate Mike Williams. He's a pretty good receiver for the Chargers. And what is this? You could win two tickets to Super Bowl, and your child could be on the next Panini Super Bowl kid reporter, blah, blah, blah. Scan the code, go online. Huh. Well, I don't have a child, but I could lie. Maybe. We'll see. I'll give it a try. Maybe it's a ticket to the Super Bowl. Joe Thomas. Antonio Gates. There's another Jerry Rice at his Hall of Fame induction speech. Jordy Nelson. Ray Lewis at his Hall of Fame. Dak Prescott Gold. Aaron Donald. Bang, I guess that's what it's called. Bang! Billy White Shoes Johnson, Drew Brees, Heinz Ward, DJ Turner Rookie, Sidney Brown Rookie, 
There's old Scary Barry Sanders. Touchdown Masters, Mike Evans, Tampa Bay. Okay. So far, we haven't really got much unless that ends up being a ticket to the Super Bowl. DJ Moore, about to watch him play Thursday Night Football here in a few minutes for the Chicago Bears. Chris Carter. Here we've got the NFL debut, Bryce Young. From what I've been hearing, these uh, horizontal NFL de debuts are not worth as much as the vertical normal cards. But I guess this is probably my best card so far. He was the number one pick in the draft. Josh Downs, rookie. Clayton Toon, rookie. Lamar Jackson, gold. And Thunder Lane, Jonathan Taylor. He was my on my fantasy football team several years, but uh, he's calling a wambulance about his contract, and I think he's supposed to start playing this month or something like that. Or this week. This weekend, maybe. Okay, last pack. So far, it has not been so hot. John Mechie, Reggie Wayne, Joe Montana, Chad Ryland, rookie Patriots, Chris Godwin, Charles Woodson, and Odell Overrated Beckham. All right, well, that was kind of a stinker. You know, I mean, the rookies, I didn't get any of the ones that are, like, really sought after. I mean, they might end up being good. Um, I am I would bet this Bryce Young is probably the best card out of the bunch. Um, yeah, I don't... I didn't get any of the the big ti the big time rookies that everybody was chasing, other than that one. All right, so next week we will compare the other one with these two and the four value packs. So there will be a another mosaic football opening. It will probably be the last mosaic football that I buy for the rest of the season. Hope everybody's doing well. Have a great day. Peace.